huge. Well, well, well you I, talked about the, the ERA, and actually that's going to be our next topic to segue in, um, is to discuss the Equal Rights Amendment. You've um, done some work on it a little bit here and there. And if we want to pull up slide 12, uh, there's a really great uh, meme of Bernie and um, one that says it's got Alice Paul in it, who wrote the, uh, equal, the equal Rights Amendment in the 1920s, it says. Um, I don't know what exact year that was, but uh, maybe, Portia, you can give us a little bit more background about that. And we'll go through slides 12, uh, 13, and 14, John, as she's talking, because they all kind of pertain to that discussion, and 15. So go ahead, Portia. <laughs> um, as far as the Equal Rights Amendment goes, I've always been for it. Um, I've been an activist for the Equal Rights Amendment, and particularly in the last, I'd say, five years. There's been a new organic grassroots uh, uprising. Uh, ER and then CTION. Um, they're one of the, the groups in the forefront fighting for the Equal Rights Amendment. There's a whole lot of others out there, uh, but I'm very, very proud of the ERA action. I was an original co-founder of that group, and I since have moved on to other things, and they're doing amazing, amazing work. Tammy Simpkins, my daughter, and Kathy Kalin are doing just amazing work there, along with a whole lot of other folks. Um, why do we want it? Well, we want it because when the Equal Rights Amendment is ratified, it means guaranteed equal pay for women. So people ask me all the time, why don't we have it? Because the businesses and those mostly white men that own those businesses don't want it because they know the minute it passes, they're not going to be able to get around not paying women their whole damn dollar. Um, it means a whole lot more. One thing in particular that I want to underscore heavily is that women go to war. Our women soldiers go to war and fight for our safety. But when they come home, they're not equal. It is an absolute travesty and embarrassment, black spot on the face of our country that we do not have the Equal Rights Amendment and we also do not have CEDAW. C-E-D-A-W, which is referred to as the Women's Treaty. Uh, I don't want to take up too much time with that, but it would not cost us a penny to ratify it in the Senate. We only need a simple majority, but once again, those white men in particular, and some of them are Democrats, they will not ratify it because the minute they do, they're out of compliance because the CEDAW Women's Treaty requires that the countries that are signed on to it have an Equal Rights Amendment in their Constitution. So it just thrills me to death that Bernie Sanders cares enough about women that he has it in his platform, and now maybe we can encourage him a little to, to speak about it at his rallies. <laughs>